hello welcome to my youtube channel today's video is about the slip test 2 which will be conducted on 18 12 2025 the action plan for 100 days ssc 2026 is announced in the state of andhra pradesh for 10th class students who write the exam in the month of march 2026 first test was over the second test will be conducted on 18 12 2025 the test paper will be given in two sets one for rising stars the other one is for shining stars rising stars paper is already prepared and a video is published here this video is relating to the slip test 2 of shining stars subject mathematics topic statistics and arithmetic one mark questions are given in an arithmetic progression ap a is equal to 2 d is equal to minus 1 find a 10 the answers to all these questions are written at the end of this question paper do not skip any part of this paper see till the end so that one can see the solutions to these questions also second one if the first term of an ap is 5 the last term is l the last term l is 45 and the sum Sn is 400, then find the number of terms n. Statement A. Sum of all 11 terms of an AP whose middle most term is 30, is 330. In an AP, sum of n terms is Sn is equal to n by 2 into 2 time 2a plus n minus 1 into d. Fourth problem. If nth term of an AP is an is equal to 3n plus 5 then match the following so n is equal to 1 if we substitute we get a1 similarly n is equal to 2 n is equal to 3 gives the successive terms so here a3 a5 and d are asked the problems are solved so one can see the answers four marks questions how many two digit numbers are divisible by three write the formula to find mode of a grouped data and explain the terms and express the terms if the sum of first n terms of an ap is 4n minus n square what is the first term what is the sum of first two terms what is the second term similarly find third tenth and nth term eighth question consider the following daily wages of 50 workers of a factory the daily wages are 500 to 520, 520 to 540, 540 to 560, 560 to 580, 580 to 600. Number of workers 12, 14, 8, 6, 10. Find the median daily wage salary. This is the complete question paper for 20 marks. You can wait till the end so that you can see the answers for these questions. The answers are for the first question the answer is a 10 is minus 7 for the second one what is n n is 16 it is calculated using the formula sn is equal to n by 2 times a plus l because the last term l is given here in the third question answer is a for the fourth question also the answer is a fifth one how many two digit numbers are divisible by 3 that is required so the two digit numbers which are divisible by 3 are 12, 15, 18 up to 99. 99 is also divisible by 3. And now we have to find the number of this term 99. So here A is 12 first term, D is 3 the common difference and A n nth term is 99 and we have to find n. For that A n is equal to A plus n minus 1 into D in which A n is 99, A is 12 n minus 1 times 3 dividing this complete equation by 3 99 4 plus n minus 1 3 gets cancels removing this bracket we get 33 is equal to this 4 minus 1 which gives 3 3 plus n so 3 plus n is equal to 33 then come n is 30 so that means there are 30 terms formula for mode is given L plus F1 minus F0 by 2, F1 minus F0 minus F2 times H. Here the terms are 
explained. Seventh problem, given Sn is equal to 4n minus n square, to get the first term, just we have to put n is equal to 1. So, n is equal to 1 is substituted and S1 is 3. So, it is S1 or A and even this A is also called A1. S2 is required to find sum to first two terms. To get sum to first two terms, substitute n is equal to 2 in this given sum to n terms. So, by substituting n is equal to 2, here we obtained 4. So, S2 is 4. That means S2 means first term plus second terms total is S2. So, that is why here S2 is A2 plus A1, in which A1 we know that it is 3. So, A2 should be 1 to get the total 4. Now, D we have to calculate. We know the second term which is 1 and first term A1 that is 3. Then the formula to find D is A2 minus A1, 1 minus 3, it is minus 2. After calculating D, the third term is required. The third term can be calculated using A3 is equal to A plus 2D. So, 3 plus 2 times minus 2. 3 minus 4 that is minus 1 and 10th term is also required to find 10th term is a 10 is equal to a plus 9 d a is 3 d is minus 2 substituting these values and calculating a 10 is minus 15 it is obtained and finally what is the nth term it is asked nth term is a plus n minus 1 into d substituting the values of a and minus d the final one we get here is 5 minus 2 n which is the nth term of the progression. Here a frequency distribution table is given 500 to 520, 520 to 540, 540 to 560, 560 to 580, 580 to 600. Frequencies are given 12, 14, 8, 6, 10 and here the total of all these frequencies is 50, 50 by 2 that is n by 2 is 25 and in CF we can see that 25 falls here in 26. So, that is why selecting this class which is 520 to 540 which gives L. So, here L is mentioned that is 520. The frequency of this class is 14 that is F and the frequency in the cumulative frequency column we have to see the preceding class we have to take here it is 12 that is CF and H is 20 one can very easily check here 500 plus 20 is 520 plus 20 is 540. So, H is 20. Substituting all these values in the formula to find the median, L is equal, median is equal to L plus N by 2 minus C of by F into H. This is the formula and here L is 520, N by 2 is 25, C of is 12, F is 14, H is 20. On simplification, here we obtained 520 plus 130 by 7, 130 by 7 after simplification or converting into decimal fraction, it gives 18.57 approximately. So, 520 plus 18.57 gives 538.57. This is the required median. So, the complete question paper for shining stars is prepared for 20 marks and the complete question paper is solved with solutions. This video is prepared and brought before you for practice purpose. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, like it, share it and write a comment. Thank you for watching.